building to the customer's number. Okay? I tell you, I say, hey, Kenny, look, um, I need to get about uh, 24 grand for my vehicle. And you know that the vehicle's worth $20,000. What would you say? I got it right on. So you need an extra key? That's two fifty. Okay. Uh, you got Hold four, on. Okay. Four curve no, three. I'll get back. You can. Okay, keep going. Key two fifty. All right. So this, okay, you you you're going where I want you to go. We build with the customer's number. In fact, when a customer tells me this, uh, tell me you want twenty four grand. I really feel like I need to get twenty four thousand dollars from my my trade. Okay. I know it's worth that. Old school, I know what I got. old school would be Kenny. Where'd you get that number? Right. Okay, confrontational. Mm -hmm. New school, Kenny. I don't know where you got that number, but I think you're right. You hit the nail right on the head. It can be worth twenty-four thousand dollars. The question is, which one of us is going to make it worth twenty-four thousand dollars? You or us? And then build up to that number. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay. But I, do, but I like the way I start, again, You're I learned this from somebody too. else. Um, you got to, instead of telling them they got a shitty number, tell them they got a great number. Mm -hmm. Brilliant. Good research. And then help them understand that it's going to take some money to make it worth that. Mm -hmm. And who can do it cheaper, you or me? The dealership the can dealership. do it cheaper. Yeah. Right. Okay, good. You guys are now, smart. So, okay, let's this, this, this take that scenario. He has a new truck. Last year we had a truck that was an old body style. This truck is a new body style. He has six, let's say four thousand miles on. It. It's really not that bad. So how would how would you handle that? Because we get that a lot. Okay. Well, th then then we're going to have to go, go to uh, let's see the bottom the bottom uh, of page four. What's it say? 